What's going on guys? Sneaker Matt one here. Um, doing a new pickup video slash review on a few things I got, not just shoes, but uh, a few other things I've gotten in the mail. I'm gonna start off with a uh, package I've gotten from Elias from Feeding the Streets. You guys should uh, subscribe to this page. I'll put a link down where I can and have that so I'm gonna open this up. One really cool thing I found out about Feeding the Streets is that, see, just something very simple like this. See, it's handwritten. It's not the, the everyday stamp you get from everyone else. It's actually handwritten. He probably did that per customer. I think it's very per, uh, personable and uh, really cool that he did that. But another really cool thing I found out about him that he does is all the stuff that he sells to people, as in the t-shirts or um, what I got from him. It all goes back into his channel. It's not for his personal pocket where he has to quit his job. Everything that he gets is uh, goes back into either the merchandise he sells or the uh, channel that he does. So I got two bags here. It's a nice, um, like a velvet material. Let's open them up and see what it is. There we go. It's a bracelet right here. This is actually pretty cool. Let's open up the other one. And all white with the two black ones. So I think this is actually pretty cool. Uh, it's the first type of race that I've gotten, so excited to see how that works out. It opens up right there. That's actually pretty cool. Excited to wear these. So, All right, let's get into the other one. I actually already opened this one up. This is from Supreme. It's a custom t-shirt that he did. Size large, 10 and a half. I think this is really cool. Um, I have a few things from Supreme. His stuff is really high quality, I know. So, there we go. See the SP for Supreme right there. You guys can see that. And then the tag, custom tag, size large, how it says Supreme right there. And I think this is really cool, the back. How it says Supreme, size so 10 and a half. That is actually the shoe size I am. So he did custom per, uh, per shirt for the size. I think that was actually really cool that he did that. I know it was a limited shirt, so I made sure to get it right away. All right. So now let's get into the shoe. Um, really excited I got this shoe, especially for the price I did. The price was unbelievable for the actual shoe. Um, this shoe doesn't even have a release date yet. doesn't even have a release month. There's not a lot of information on the shoe. So when I, was, when I saw it, grab it right away as soon as I can. Um, so let's get into it. Starts off with white rope laces. These are the second laces. And here is the shoe. The Nike SB Janowski, known as the Wino or Blood Splatter, depending on what you guys want. Um, I had to wear my Boomande Halloween shirt to, to represent these shoes. I'll post a link for these guys. Really cool guys. Great shop in the suburbs. Um, Help me out with a lot of stuff. So. Here, these are going to get some good angle shots. I think it's really cool that um, each shoe is different with the stains of the wine or the blood, whatever you want to consider it. All right, so let's get into it. On the outer sole is a gum bottom, like every other Janowski. And on the uh, midsole, it is white with a maroon lining. All of this, the Toe box, the side panel, and back heel area is all a canvas with, of course, the wine or blood splatter with a maroon stitched in swoosh on each side and the tongue tag for daily use Janowski Nike skateboarding. And it came with the tan laces, very simple shoe. What I thought was cool on the inside, Nike SB in the red and the stains all in there too and that is on each shoe and I'll be showing what you what these look like on feet right now I used to love 
government cheese. We lived in a shitty house. I grew up around coke like you grew up around Mickey Mouse. The mirrors had residue. My clothes were second hand. We had no revenue. My kicks were pathetic, man. Destroyed competitors. Show off and show them up. Treat check. Alright guys, those are what the Janowskis look like on feet. Let me know what you think about them. Um, I think it was a really cool shoe. Happy I got them for the price they did. Um, I personally hope it's not a hype shoe. I hope everyone can get it, get a set if they want a set. So, like, comment, subscribe to my page. Um, help me guys, I really appreciate it. So definitely uh, keep in touch and subscribe like I said before. And thanks guys, keep your laces tight.